We're a little bit dark today in the kitchen guys, which is not too good. My hand's quite shaky. So, hi and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi my name's Rosie. How is everybody doing? Happy Saturday. I didn't have to think about it today. <laughs> so I've just been and done a bit of shopping because if you're not aware, it is the summer holidays in the UK. My name's Rosie. As I said, I generally upload two to three times a week. Lifestyle, vlogs. So if you enjoy that kind of content and you enjoy this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. I know it's a little bit premature, but it just kind of helps me understand what you guys like. And obviously, as I said, it helps my channel. Also, if you haven't already, I would love for you to subscribe to my channel. So don't forget to obviously press the subscribe button and the notification button because it lets you know when I upload. Also, I am on Instagram. I generally upload on my stories daily. So if you would like to, I would love if you would go over and give me a following on my Instagram. It's at Rosie Simpson, double underscore. Just trying to grow my platforms, guys. And I would love to have you in my families. So yes, um, as I was saying, so today is I've been to Tesco's, picked up a few bits and pieces, went to Tesco's because I can't get in Tesco's, I'm lying, I can get in Tesco's. <laughs> yeah, I just thought I'd, I'd, I'd go to Tesco's. Um, spent about £160, saved about £20 and I am just going to, so I'm going to turn you around, I'm not going to kind of mess about today because it's quite, I'm just going to look at this guys, it's quite late in the afternoon and I am, we usually go swimming on a Saturday, so I'm just going to get into it guys and we can have like a little chat as I usually do through, as I'm going through bits and pieces. So I've just picked up what I needed, it's, yep, yeah, this is it, so we'll just get into it. Tesco, oh god there's a big old glare on that, sorry guys, as I said it's a bit dark today, I don't know what the sun's doing, I am sweating because it's really muggy in the UK but other than that where I live it's, it, I don't think it knows what it wants to do today but to be fair I don't think it wants to know what it wants to do any day, um, so Tesco's scourers, I just picked these up because unfortunately my scrub mummy is looking rather sad for itself and I need to replace it but I've just, yeah, I wanted a little bit of a break from the scrub on me, so I've just picked the scourers up um, and scrub daddies, guys. So, yeah. Venus Oceana razors. Um, these were on offer. I haven't put prices on, guys, because unfortunately, time is not on my side today. Um, I do apologise. I will try, I think, maybe in the next couple of hauls. Um, to get prices but as I've said many a time prices keep changing so yeah I can't always, I just can't keep up with it at the moment um Andrex toilet rolls this is the mega rolls this is 12 times mega rolls 50 more sheets I wonder if that's on each roll it looks like it is um longer lasting and again these were on offer these were nine pounds something so they were under 10 pound I picked those up and yes they're already open because unfortunately it is raw family life um, <laughs> and I needed the loo when I got back in and we'd run out of toilet roll so yeah one of the reasons why I went to Tesco's <laughs> um, body foam ultra night ultra large night pads um, I know these are on offer at the moment three for two or three for something Three for three pounds something. I only, I just picked up the one pack. And then I've picked up some Palmer's Cocoa Butter. Um, this was on offer. And then I also picked up some Dove because, again, this is cruelty free. It's not tested on animals, guys. And this is the tan. Um, this is really rubbish because I've got, a, I've got a, like a glare. I do apologise guys, I don't know if anybody else can see that. Um, this is the light to medium, I'm going to give that a go because I'm sick of being pasty white 
and I'm too lazy to do my tan all the time but I do moisturize daily so I'm thinking even if it's just for my legs so I'm going to give that a shot if any of you guys have tested this out previous let me know how it is in the comments what's it like um is it any good so this was on offer as well as I said then for the snake in my life <laughs> <laughs> literally a snake i have a snake pet snake um i just picked up some wood shavings because he needs cleaning out and these were only a pound and i just had to grab them quickly and um, usually i do get the bigger packets but yeah i was in a hurry so i grabbed them um burritos chili heat wave two packs of these um because we're gonna make chicken tenders doritos chili heat wave chicken tenders tonight we're going to try them. We're going to make them. So, yeah, I'll let you know how that goes. That's because tonight's Saturday, so we usually have pizzas on a Saturday because we go swimming and stuff, and then when we get back, we have pizzas. So Saturday night's usually pizza night. So we're going to try and have these as well, see what they taste like. I shall let you know. Um, quavers, just the variety bag, eight cheese, six prawn, six barbecue. Kids like these. Just pick them up, yeah, something something for them to snack on. Um, clover, buttermilk, again, this one off, I think it's about three pounds, so I grabbed that. Um, sugar, I literally just picked up the big bags because it's two pounds for the big bag. And to be fair, we have been using, I mean, I don't have sugar in anything, but the kids have been using, I've just been filling the sugar pot up with caster sugar. Is it caster sugar? You know the one that you um, they cook, you cook with, caster sugar. Does anybody else do that? So, because I kept forgetting to buy granulated sugar. I mean, it's the same thing. It's just a lot smoother. But anyways, I picked the sugar up. Um, pro milk. These are the protein milkshakes. These are Tesco's ones. I think these are like the Aldi ones, to be fair. But Aldi doesn't always have them in. Not my Aldi anyways. Um, and these are 20 grams of protein and I know these are about £1.14 each so I picked four of those oh, just some handle, high handle food bags because usually I need these for I use these for like chicken and stuff and if we're going to go out anywhere or you know I'm doing like pack lunches um, I use these and yeah I've run out so I needed to pick some of them up um, £1.45 I think guys Baby spinach because I plan on doing a curry at some point, homemade curry. Um, no jars, no sauces, I generally just do it myself. Um, I find then at least I know what's going in it and I find it to be a bit cheaper as well because I usually already have the stuff in the cupboard so I'm just going to do a curry at some point, maybe that chicken. Um, and then for tomorrow I'm going to do, oh gosh, some baked potatoes. So I picked up you can even see that guys i picked up two bags of those and um, you get four in each bag so that's eight some large onions these were i think just over a pound um around about a pound yeah sorry guys if you're a regular shopper to tesco's then you'll know what the price of these are <laughs> maybe you can let me know um just some plums these were on offer i think these were like 59 pence each and children absolutely loves these just something healthy um stuffed peppers i usually buy these when i go to tesco's absolutely love these and usually you can pick up like three for two but i only wanted one pack today so i just picked up one and about two pound each some salmon dragon roll this is the yo that obviously is in my Tesco's. Well, you won't know that, so it's not obviously. <laughs> um, this was obviously should have pros. The price is on there. It's six pound twenty-five. A little bit of a splurge, and it did look a lot prettier than this before it went into the bag. To be fair, um, I've kind of like destroyed it, but I will eat these probably very very shortly before I go swimming for my lunch. And they're yeah raw fish, so but they do other types and stuff. I just can't help myself. I love sushi absolutely love sushi um pepperami protein kicks these are the hot ones pick those up because they were on offer and then again pick the original ones up because they were on offer i tend to find that through the holidays what usually people would put in like pack lunches for the kids and stuff always tends to go on offer so i usually grab them which is good i think they were just like two pounds 25 each so i picked up two of those then just a family staple oh god do you know what i'm just going to prop it up against there guys family staple just some chicken um this is like the chicken breast fillets 
and I picked up two of those, they were £9 each, so, and it's all going to slide down the pack. I said I usually open this and I split it up and I put it into the sandwich bags and we just get it out as we need it because um, we eat a lot of chicken in this house. I spotted these the last time I was in Tesco's but I didn't pick them up. These are Brie Slices and as far as I'm aware they're quite new to Tesco's I think. Correct me if I'm wrong guys um, and if I am I do apologise but yeah I just thought I'd pick them up because I do like a little bit of Brie and my daughter Megan absolutely loves Brie so yeah and it's quite it's a bit of a faff when you've got to mess about with it and stuff because I never know if you can eat the rind that kind of covers it is it rind I, I can't remember what it's called anyways the stuff that covers it I know you can but I kind of always you know when you're just unsure if that makes sense anyways yeah so pick those up Leah's armor this is new well I found it well it says it's new I'm um, not sure how long it's been in Tesco's but this is already grated and I love this cheese so I picked two bags of those up and I know it was two for four pounds um oh gosh guys Ugh. right so we'll pick these up it's some these packets are bigger than my hands chicken drumsticks i just picked up this is like a massive um pack i just picked one of those up because with this i can either do like a chicken casserole or i can do something else i'll find something to do with it um and these were, I think these were on offer as well. They're like three pounds something. I think because the weather's so bad at the moment, all the barbecue stuff that they usually would, you know, make a killing on, um, they're struggling to sell it. So, yeah. Um, we need the sun to come back. Some British thin cut beef steaks. Again, I just picked these up. These are on par with Aldi like the same price it's like yeah um Tesco's Aldi price match so these were on these were just over three pounds good in a sandwich or like a what do they call it like a flatbread or something yeah or just fry them up and put them with whatever <laughs> little rice noodles that kind of thing um or yeah a cheesy put cheese in with a pita that's what I usually do in a bit of salad um Cathedral City grab that that was on offer heck sausages these are the chicken Italian ones again £2.50 on offer pepperami I've not had these before pepperami chicken roasted bites I think they're maybe like the other like little chicken bites that you can get the protein ones it was high in protein four in the pack and again on offer at five. grab them then I know it's not hot chocolate season but we've kind of promised the kids we would get some hot chocolate but I forgot to get the hot chocolate because the story along that line is is today's haul was supposed to be like a double it was supposed to be because I wanted to go to Aldi as well but I kind of ran out of time as I said so the Aldi I will have to go to Aldi. Um, my plan was was to do half in Aldi and half in Tesco's to obviously get what I needed in Tesco's and then go to Aldi for my other bits. Um, just to kind of see, you know, if it, it would save me some pennies, which I think it would. Um, so, yeah, I will be making a call to Aldi very, very shortly because I didn't pick everything up in Tesco's that I needed for the rest of the week because this is like, this is towards next week's shop if that makes sense anyways i want to shut up problem so yeah hot chocolate because i am in my fake out era at the moment so i picked up some milk chocolate vermish is it vermicelli just the sprinkles and then i picked up this as well red velvet dusting now i know usually this is for cakes and stuff but i just thought you know what make a nice little kind of like difference you know if you put um over the sprinkle it over the top of the, the cream pink and white marshmallows these are the little baby ones for the hot chocolate so i do need to as i said i will go to aldi probably tomorrow when i have a bit more time on my hands to pick up a few bits and pieces plus i need to get tuna and stuff for the jacket taters anyways so yeah um garlic flatbreads again this was on offer I do like a bit of garlic bread with my pizza night um crumpets 
We haven't had crumpets in ages and Xander asked for these and they're like £1.25 or £1.15 each. Something along those lines. I will have a look in a moment if I remember. Um, but yeah, I used to buy crumpets all the time and then as I said, I kind of um, got, you know, you just eat something constantly. We got sick of eating them so I haven't bought them in absolutely ages. Um, but I thought I'd pick two packets up because Xander was asking for them. So yeah. Rice Krispie Squares, again the mint chalk shake, apparently these are absolutely really nice, the kids are raving about these. And the cookies and cream ones, because these were on offer as well. Tesco's Perfectly Ripe Gold and Kiwis, sweet and juicy. I bought these I think in the last Tesco haul and you know what, they're absolutely beautiful. Oh, so yeah, highly recommend if you like, if you like kiwi. They don't taste like the ones that you know, like the small ones that you get out of the bags and stuff, for so the, the taste I don't know, they're sweeter and there's more flavour to them if that makes sense. But yeah, really nice. Blueberries, two for three pounds. Pick two up. So I've run out of blueberries, but I've still got plenty of strawberries, which makes a change. Um, Tesco's finest. I've not had this before. Four cheese bread with pangratato. I've not had it, but it sounds... That's what it says guys. It sounds and looks absolutely delicious and it was on the meal deal for I think it was a pizza and a flatbread for £6 so I've had that. Grabbed a large pack of crunches because we use these for swimming. Tesco's. This is the milk chocolate fluffy pillows. Um, just over a pound. Tesco's chalk snaps 89p. Again Aldi price match. Tesco's rice snaps again under a pound and then some Cheerios large box and these are four pounds um, just makes a change from the usual that we normally get I do like to kind of like change it up every now and then Lipton iced tea this is like the big size that was two pound a bottle um, just because I actually really like iced tea and I wanted to try the peach one. Um, I don't generally drink juice unless it's already pre-made and in a bottle. I don't know, I'm just weird like that. Um, so yeah, Ribena, no added sugar. This was £2.75 so I just picked that up as a change from, because I usually buy the kids Vimto and stuff like that, but I just thought maybe, I know Ribena and Vimto are very, like, similar in taste and stuff but yeah ribena we do like a ribena um pizzas because it's pizza night picked up tesco's stone baked pepperoni this is for Jaden. i will explain why in a moment ham and pineapple pizza for lexi because lexi loves that and this is the fresh one and i didn't realize it was already at the bottom of my basket and i should know this because aldi do the same thing why do the charge extra because this is this was two pounds, two pounds something, and it was meant to be on offer because obviously Tesco's were pushing it, which was absolutely fine. So I grabbed it because I know Lexi likes ham and pineapple. But when I've gone to round the corner to pick up the frozen ones, because then I clicked on obviously, that um, the frozen ones when I got to there, I realised were cheaper by about a pound. I don't understand why it costs more money for the fresh ones than it does the frozen ones i don't know because aldi and that do this do exactly the same um but this was already buried in at the bottom of the trolley if that makes sense so i wasn't literally going in and digging out for a pound um it is what it is guys <laughs> it's fine i had this before it's actually really nice um and this is kind of like an healthier option of yeah pizza um, which to be fair at the moment I'm not too fussed because although I do like to try and eat healthy I also like my food and I am a proper foodie and I love anything like this um, and I've also got a very sweet tooth as well so I kind of like yeah tonight's I mean I've, I'll have been swimming so I'll have made up you know for it and everything so anyways spicy garlic king brawn wood fired pizza this is 
for me and whoever else wants a slice. Um, it's also got chilies on it, and well, fresh chilies on it and stuff, which is very nice. And as I said, I have had this before, um, and it's actually a really nice pizza if you like prawns. Then, Kenzie, Marley, and um, Megan, and Jaden, no, because Jaden's has already gone. Right, so this is the stuffed crust loaded pizza. So this will do then for anybody that wants it. Now this is stuffed crust, which they're actually really nice. Um, and then this is the chicken and bacon melt, and that's another stuffed crust. Right, so I, know I said I would explain. For those of you that are regulars to my channel, um, you will remember me saying Jaden does not like the stuffed crusts. So Jaden is on the spectrum and basically if something doesn't look right or it doesn't look how it, he's used to it looking, he will not eat it. Um, and that's the issue that I have with these because they're stuffed crusts. He doesn't like the stuffed crusts so and it doesn't look like it's supposed to in his mind. It doesn't look like that. So yeah. I have to buy separate which I'm not fussed as long as he's happy as long as everybody's happy to be fair you know that's what it's all about this was on offer so I've not had this before I mean it's just milkshake generally I don't drink milkshake because it makes me feel ill but the kids eat it eat it the kids drink it so I thought I'd give this a shot it was an offer it was £1.50 I picked up two apparently this is the it's not apparently because it actually is the real milkshake <laughs> oh I picked up two chocolate honestly Rose like seriously what am I like and then I picked up the salted caramel now I do like salted caramel so to be fair guys whether this gives me a bad stomach or not you just know I'm gonna taste it I'm not bothered I don't care I'm a glutton for punishment Sweet barbecue pulled pork, spotted two of, no I didn't spot two of these, oh my god. <laughs> I just think I need to quit and give up now. Um, these were on offer, so I bought two. <laughs> and I just thought it'll be nice in a bun or something, you know, just as a change from a burger or chicken or, you know. Or you could have it with chicken, I don't know, maybe a bit of salad. Anyways, yeah, we'll see. So I picked up two of those. And then just a little treat, another little treat. I love fresh bread. Absolutely love fresh bread. I spotted these. This is Tesco's own limited edition Mediterranean style and it's a tear and share. Um, and it looks really nice. And what happens is I bought two, so then everybody gets a bit. Um, I'll just have this tonight actually. After swim and come home, pizza night, movie night, and then take it from there. So this is it, guys. That was my... I'm going to pop these in the freezer. Because, again, it says that it's... I'm just getting the view of my amazing kitchen. Again, it says that it's fresh door. So, yeah, I wouldn't want to give anybody food poisoning. Um, that's the last thing on my mind. So that's it, guys. That's my haul. Just turn these round. It's gone really dark, hasn't it? It's really dark. I'm sweating. I've got this great big thick jumper on, which is actually so overworn. I stuck it in the dryer, and unfortunately, the black bit came off. But I'm not chucking it. It's still wearable. If you haven't already, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, <laughs> and if you would, my loves, please subscribe to my channel. I would love to have you in my YouTube family. I'm also over on Instagram at Rosie Simpson, double underscore. I upload two to three times a week. If you like lifestyle vlogs, hauls, that kind of thing, then yeah, please check out my platforms. I'm just trying to grow them. I shall see you all in the next video. Lots of love. Stay safe. Again, take care. Bye-bye.